Hello everyone and welcome to a slightly delayed solo cash cup video. Today we're taking a look at the fifth solo cashy of the season and how I played it. And I'll also talk about the difficulty I currently face when it comes to improving throughout the video. Because the past few days or maybe even weeks, I just haven't felt an ounce of improvement. And I'll also go over what I think is the solution. So make sure to stick around. But now let's have a look at how this tournament started off. The difficulty I have with improving is probably similar to a lot of you guys watching. Right now, it feels like whether I play 8 hours a day or 0 hours a day, I'll perform the exact same. It's just incredibly frustrating when you take a week and you grind your ass off before a tournament just to do worse than expected. Even when playing customs and playing tokens, you feel no sense of improvement. You just have to play it and fully trust the process. And what I've figured out recently is that I am incredibly bad at trusting the process. I genuinely think, even though I know it is objectively wrong, that I'll perform the same whether I grind or not. This is because there has been one too many tournaments where I haven't performed even though I have put in quite a lot of time. Maybe I'm just not as big a grinder as others. Maybe my threshold for what I consider grinding is much lower than everyone else competing. But I need to get a grip and start trusting the process of playing customs and creative against good players. Because it doesn't just take one week to achieve your goals in competitive Fortnite. It doesn't just take one month. It's a process that takes multiple months. And the funny part is that once I get that one top 50 placement in the Duo Cash Cup or that one tournament where I get earnings, I know things will start moving faster in terms of improvement.
GG. Another reason I feel as though I don't improve is because I never think of myself as the best player in the lobby. I always look at a feed and think, wow, this guy is getting a lot of elims. He must be really good. Or I see a name I recognize and I instantly think, oh, so I'm not the best player in here because he who has 5x my PR is playing. But one thing that randomly popped up on my YouTube was a video where a guy talks about how he played the best tennis player in the world. And the reason he lost wasn't because his skill was necessarily worse, but it was because he went into the match thinking about the fact that he was playing against the best tennis player in the world. The first two sets went directly to his opponent, but in the second set he won a game. And it was only then he started thinking, I can actually compete with this guy. Before that one game win, his mentality was fixated on him playing against the best, not the fact that he could actually compete against them. And this is exactly how I feel in so many of my tournament games. And it's a mentality that I'm working on improving. Oh. 
Oh, what? Oh my god. Wow. I wasn't originally planning on making this video as I didn't qualify, but I decided to do it anyways because maybe this somehow can be beneficial for some of you watching. I think moving forward, I need to trust the process of grinding way more, even though I don't feel any sense of improvement in the moment I play. Thank you all for watching all the way till the end. I'm sorry for the disappointing performance, but I did my absolute best and I can't do more than that.